Like exploring the great outdoors while having access to wine tasting and fine dining, then we have an idea. Yeah, it's called the Vintages Trailer Resort, and it might just be the place for you. Our Cor Harlan live this morning with more about all of this, and it looks pretty cool out there. Oh, this is cool, Ken. If you haven't been out here, this is really neat. This is retro trailer, mid-century modern trailers that have been renovated and put into some really nice living uh, conditions here. The trailer behind us is the new addition to the fleet that they have out here at the Vintages Trailer Resort. And I'm going to have Carl just walk you in there because this is a really cool trailer. Therese Strait is, uh, is with me. She's the manager here. Here's the voice you will hear. Now tell folks what they are looking at here, Therese, as we walk in here for the this, because this has not even uh, this has not even been used once yet. Has no, it? this is our brand new addition to the lane. It's a 1956 Spartan Mansion. Really cool. 36 feet long. 36 feet long offers a nice big kitchen area, king size bed, and a little surprise out back. Really cool. Check out some of the craftsmanship in here, and I mean, this is nice. What are these? Hard hard surface countertop, Corian countertop or something of that nature? Yeah, yeah quartz yeah. countertop. Mm -hmm. Well, they have gone through here and used local contractors to really dress this up. Carl, do a little pirouette, spin around there and show folks. This is the would be the living room area, the TV up there, the sofa that's built into the what would be the front of this trailer. It is really cool. So this is, uh, it's, it is sort of retro on the outside, but it is very modern with all the modern conveniences on the inside, a microwave, refrigerator, uh, kitchen sink back here. Come on back, Therese and Carl. We kind of walk our way back towards the back of the trailer. And at 36 feet long, you get the, uh, you get the real feel of spaciousness here. Check out the shower tub there, Carl, nice to the right. It is really nice. Yeah, yeah. How long does it take to design something like this and how long to put them together? I think it only took us two and a half months to complete this project. And no one has slept in here yet, correct? I have. You have. All right. <laughs> Who's taken a bath in here so far? I have. You have. All right. Well, we're going to add another person to that list today. Here's the bedroom back here, Carl. King size uh, bed. bed, beautiful, uh, ventilated. And here's the surprise out here off of the back porch. And it's a little dark this morning, so forgive uh, forgive a little bit of the darkness. Carl, come out here with his light out here. This is a totally enclosed sort of a back porch area with a very nice soaking tub that is about to have the second person in it a little bit later on this morning. This is total privacy, and people love that about this place, do they not? Yes, absolutely. This is uh, one of the most incredible experiences I've ever had here in the lane. Sit up here in the tub, Jenny and Ken. Look at the stars or the clouds. Uh, actually, this is this. It is a rainy morning, but you know what? If you're in a tub like this in a warm tub of water, a little bit of rain is not going to spoil the party. From the Vintages Trailer Resort this morning here in Dundee, where we're waiting for the sun to come up and the rain to fall or not to fall. Who cares? With a warm tub like that, it makes no difference at all. Hmm. Yeah, Kelly just asked us, do you think Cora's really going to get, like, naked? <laughs> we said no. <laughs> no. I mean, you'll get in. Well, I don't... I don't know. I would. I would probably. Right? I would say even money at this point. Well, this is a family-friendly <laughs> show. Even money. All right. Yeah. I thought you would at least have some skivvies on, but that's you know. Okay. I've got skivvies. Yeah. I got some skivvies. Right, well, I, this... I could probably do skivvies in here. They're <laughs> green. Tees. They're green, yeah. by the way. Oh, green. Great. All right. Yeah. For Oregon, cool. you know, Oregon <laughs> is green. Sure. Right. Yeah. Okay. Sure. okay. Well, we can't wait for that. Yeah, I mean, that's an overstatement sure? probably. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, we are keeping an eye on your traffic and weather together right now. And Kelly, what a rainy morning it's been. It really has been. We're starting